Hey guys, it's Pones and welcome back to the channel, welcome back to a brand new match day vlog and yes, today, the start of the new season, Stoke's first game at home against Rotherham United and I'm so excited and nervous at the same time, um, excited, it's a brand new season, football is finally back properly and we're going to get all the football action, obviously all the way up until May and like, I'm a bit nervous as well cause, because it's the first game of the season, um, but obviously the players we brought in, we brought in 11 players including like Luke McNally since um, the Everton game. I'm just excited. I'm nervous to see what they do together. I'm excited, but I'm nervous. But I think Rotherham, it should be, I don't know, it won't be an easy game, but obviously no game is easy in the Championship, but I'm expecting a win. And just like last season, I'm going to do a prediction for every game. And I'm going to say, we're going to come out with the blocks firing. I don't see us losing to Rotherham. I'm going to say Stoke win three goals to nil. And I'm going to say Ryan May gets two. And maybe Wesley off the bench might get a third. But that's my prediction. I think Ryan May will start. I'm excited to see how him and Vidigel and again Shukini have all do. It's a strong squad. So without further ado, it is raining quite badly. But nevertheless, it's not going to stop us. Let's go down to the, the bet 365 and see if Stoke can get a good start to the season. That's what we want. Three, game, three points available, three points to get. Come on, Stoke. So starting 11's out, mind the wet loop, it is absolutely pouring it down, typical wet stoop. Uh, I don't think we're going for like a 4-2-3-1 at the moment, I think it's Ryan Mai up top, Brown just behind it, Vidigal and Daniel Johnson on the wing. Ben Pearson is in the starting 11 with uh, new captain Josh Lerod, and we've got Hoover, Wilmot, Rose and one other at the back <laughs> with uh, Travis and Gold. Obviously a strong, strong squad, I think what's stronger than Rotherham's on paper. That's why I'm still going for our nice 3-0 victory yesterday. Come on, Stoke. Number 16, Ben Wilmot. 
the back post, off the bar and in. Get in! Thinking about it, then.
Andre. Oh, what a ball as well. Seconds. And again. Well done. Oh, right, my so close to a third. Travis. Oh, 
Time Stoke City 4 1 victors in the end, and again, well deserved. I didn't do a half time analysis, but 3 0 up at the break, two goals within injury time, seven minutes injury time in both halves as well, which is crazy. But new EFL rules and cracking down on time wasting, so I guess I understand it. But a uh, goal from Keanu Hoover to first goal of the season, and great finish. Took to anything, I just mistimed it, but ball to the back stick. and hit it down and it's the cross bar and then back of the net so great finish and then two goals from Vidi Gel as well one at the back I think it was one of the back posts he tapped in uh, and also one off the second attempt on goal and she hit off the post and then so going in at 3-0 very strong obviously slept I think a little bit in the first two minutes of the first start the second half sorry with uh, Robin pulling one back through I think it was Porti I think it was Porti or something like that just got subbed on at half time got scored within the first minute of the second half but obviously Jacob Brown grabbing Stokes fourth at the back stick from a corner. Great finish. So couldn't ask for a better start and even better, like I showed at the end of the game, Vale lost seven nil. So great, 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 great game. Stoke, obviously, Taylor doesn't really matter, but Stoke a second. Obviously we go the next league game is against Ipswich, but we have West Brom in the cup on Tuesday or the Wednesday, I think it's Tuesday. So like another way to test ourselves, West Brom lost to Blackburn. And Ipswich play tomorrow. I think they've got Sunderland, I believe, um, away from home. So that'll be a test for them. But can't go wrong for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, give us a like. If you're new, hit subscribe as well. Because I've posted a load of Stoke City content. And yeah, you can stay up to date. You can cancel any time. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this vlog. I certainly did. Great game. So all I can say is parents. I'm signing out. And peace. Come on.